seven part mini series showcasing some of the greatest customizers in our community and this is all centered around HCS, the Halo Championship Series Final. Last month the community created 24 scaled down versions of people's cosplays in miniature MCX form. And now we've been showing them off one by one with a ton of extra stuff that the custom creators provided us to show off yep. on camera. To let y'all see some master artwork. Exactly, so part one we checked out all of their works, all of the scaled down cosplayers. Then we've been looking at work from Buster, Riot, Towny, and today, NSI. He be balling. He does be balling. <laughs> so without further ado, let's check out NSI's custom work. In the previous episode, we had a look at some grotesque looking flood from Towny Customs. And today we're looking at NSI. So these are the four figures that he created to show off at the Halo Championship Series. I just looked at the camera. These look so good. This work is just so much fun. And the sun is coming out in the window next to us. So these figures are just going to look nicer and nicer every episode. Which is a, a reason you should check back every episode. In today's episode, he said sent us some extra figures to check out today and we're shipping these back to him. They look so good on this camera, dude. So the nice. saturation on this one, it, it's just where I have to begin. This elite honor guard, man. Like, it's so pretty. I, I thought we had the perfect elite honor guard, but this is just, I, I didn't think like uh, like basic matte colors would work. Would make it work as Yeah, well. as good as metallic, but it really, really does. So big shout out to that. It's just such a basic figure, just highlighted in the best way possible. I am in love with that Elite. Which one do you want to go for next, Johnny? I think we should go yeah. for his <laughs> first. This is his first Sig Fig. Wow. And this is an LS3D printed uh, light machine gun. I don't remember the specific. I love that he calls it a Sig Fig. Signature figures, a classic thing to have in the Mega Bloks community. Mm. And this is one of his originals. Well, I mean, here's and... Strandy 42 Sig Fig. Yep, and that one's right. Do I, I need a Sig Fig? I need a Sig Fig. I think you do have a, technically a Sig Fig. I'm hosting a competition for the Sig Fig. My Sig Fig is Billy the Grunt. <laughs> Billy the Grunt. Just some really great work. Yeah. Good uh, grenades attached to the side, pouch and stuff. Thoroughly enjoyed what's going on here. That's, a, that's an LS3D um, LMG. Yep. Wow. And it is that's doing crazy. doing great work dude. with what they're doing. The tack pad looks great. Mm -hmm. And I always can appreciate soft pack. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah. That oh is that so is that Ellis's particularly? No, I think that one is uh, Dougie's. Dougie's, yeah, this is yep. Dougie's uh, soft pack. We've got a CQC shoulder and a custom sculpted wrist. And another LS3D print is this Mark VI helmet, the version 4. So on LS3D's website, you can choose different versions, which are basically different helmet attachments. That just looks so good. So good. In terms of a signature figure, that's what you want. That's incredible. It's really good. We got two more figures here. Let's go for this Johnson. We're just going yeah. in a row here. What do we think of this strand? He's solid. Yeah. It's a yeah. solid figure. He's a your classic Sergeant Johnson chomping green machine badass. Yeah, wow. That's Actually, low-key, that's a really well-sculpted head. I love the searing red end of the cigar. Would you just look at that print on the hat there? These that guys, is incredible. These guys in their UNSC logos have been absolutely nailing it. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Couldn't agree more. The weathering on that Spartan laser is incredible. This is the best-looking Sergeant Johnson I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, it's pretty stinking good. Yeah, it's really good. And the head is so expressive. Uh, I can hear him shouting in my ear right now. I think it's a 3D print from one of the guys. Whoa! Whoa, Strandy, did we just plane shift? Did we go to a different existence? My internal... It certainly feel like we did. Now, we uh, just got kicked out of the room we were in, so we're filming upstairs in the attic. And while the lighting is a tiny bit less, the figures do all the work, baby. Like, we've been looking at this Johnson that was our previous figure. Just such an uncanny likeness, which is really difficult to get from a figure. Like, really difficult to get. And the final figure of this showcase is this gorgeous Mark 7. So this is using an SYI Mark 7 conversion kit. NSI's main sig fig, and this guy is special. We also have discontinued Highcom shoulders. There's now a new version. This is an old LS3D print because it uses the old Reach bicep. We've also got two one millimeter magnets. Oh, bet you didn't see that one coming. So good. Magnets. What on earth? And you can buy these off Amazon. They're super easy to find. Chip. Mm. The clicking sound. The clicking sound is that, let's see. Great paint job, very sort of dark and, and menacing. Can barely even see the visor with that much just like heavy wash on it. It's a great figure. Really, really cool. Beautiful knife. Grenadier Mark V legs, AAP utility belt. They're all LS3D's work. I'm, I'm blown away. I'm always blown away. I mean, just, just, 
That's amazing. So big shout out to NSI for putting this excellent showcase together. Thank you very much. You sent a really awesome selection. I've just been so blown away by this so far. Epic figures from an epic member of the community and join us next time for Shipmaster, the, the brute ship staggered line. The number is three to one. That's probably yeah, it is an even just, fight. Just about or both of that one. Or their little hides. Sorry. Okay, yeah, join us next time. And <laughs> this shout out to you all. You stay awesome, you stay safe. And the Elite Honor Guard, Protector of the Sangheili, is signing off.